Hey everyone, this is Song 007 1986. Oh boy, another day, another day, another reason why uh, people are abusing YouTube. And here I thought Elon Musk could uh, take it over with Fowley. We'll have stopped with all the unnecessary bullshit. Well, apparently it's not. And if, I, and if Elon Musk. If I'm Elon Musk, I get on this situation because I feel like it's bullshit. So apparently, Ezra Blue, Ezra Blue, a woman who is famous of running a podcast against human trafficking, has decided to go on a fucking war path or whatsoever against YouTubers. And let's see, she she got Twitter to ban YouTubers Brittany Venti. And according over posting YouTube screenshots of Ezra Blue, Blue, don't believe me? Well, I don't believe you if you don't believe me, but I'm a believe me. Or if you do, that that'd be pretty awesome. But I'm gonna read this. I mean, this from bounding into comics because I feel like this is important. Oh, and also, and also, Yellow Flash got got um banned off of Twitter for seventy. Let me read this. Twitter bans Brittany Venti and the quartering over posting YouTube screenshot of Ezra Blue. Twitter suspended YouTubers Brittany Venti and the quartering on Friday after both posted screenshots of a publicly posted hip hop music video from YouTube. Keep in mind, let me say that publicly posted hip hop music video on YouTube. That's important. The suspension, the suspensions came after a mass flagging, after a mass flagging campaign for friends of Ezra Blue, a woman famous for running a podcast against human trafficking. Venti post, quest, posted questioning Blue's authenticity in speaking out against human trafficking and the sexualization of women because the video features Blue posing sexually. Uh, yeah, I can't pronounce that word for the life of me. So. Bear with me now. Along the, with, with posting the screenshot of the video, Venti said, if she addressed it before, before, let me know. Let me know. But I'm just curious because I come across videos like this. Maybe she was trafficking via being gross. I don't know. Venti also tweeted, I saw this tweet just, just now, but I think it starts to blur the lines about what is trafficking versus what was voluntary. I think it's fair to ask the questions when the things like this distracts from the anti-trafficking messaging when it's not clarified. Tw Twitter locked Venti out of her account for a tweet claiming she violated Twitter rules for... for violating our rules against against posting or certainly privately distributed, produce and distribute intimate media with someone without their express consent. Again, what she said was publicly posted. What? At least one of the tweets was reported by an account named Amanda Jean, who said, and I quote, mm -mm. Also, I'm reporting this for non-consensual image. You don't, you didn't have to post that screenshot, you salty hoe. Ezra Blue has previously been doing good work exposing human trafficking and child grooming, which was highlighted by the Daily Wire in 2022, bringing Blue's podcast to new public prominence. What happened between her and Venti to cause beef between the two isn't clear, but in this instance, it appears that Blue is in the wrong for advocating for deplatforming based on public appearances. I agree, 1,000%. The video in question remains on YouTube, easily searchable by anyone who might want to take a screenshot of Blue stripping for the camera. Despite Twitter's proper confirmation, this does not qualify as sharing private intimate media or any kind of revenge for it. Venti appears to be asking the artist question. Well, it didn't stop Blue from playing the victim of the situation. She threatened Venti after the incident, tweeting, I'm going to address this one time and one time only. A non-consensual photo was posted of me yesterday on Twitter. The photos have been removed. The source of the photo has also been contacted, and I'm prepared to escalate it to the fullest extent of the law. Blue Day continued, Twitter did an outstanding job, and they will be excluding from legal action. There won't be anyone else involved. 
involve spare. I take days all the way and have no chill. I am a survivor advocate, advocate, and that doesn't stop with advocating for myself as a survivor. I encourage my enemies to study the law. I have been for many years. It might stop you from making rookie mistakes in the future, she tweeted. Ugh. Prominent, several prominent YouTubers took exception to Blue's grandstanding, including the Quarterly, who reposted Venti's tweet and was suspended as well as... as it was suspended as well as his tweet deleted. Before his suspension, he posted, and I quote, I, ha I had never had a bad interaction with Eliza Blue, and the same for Brindy Brittany Venti. I have a major issue with Brittany getting her account locked for a posting a public image. Her account was locked for sharing private images, but this is not, a, not in the case. Please fix this, Elon Musk. And Elon Musk. Ross, Ross alert. Dear everyone, a person named Brittany Vendy has been wrongfully censored and locked out of her Twitter account due to sharing a public video and asking a question on on an old music video that Eliza Blue did a while back. A while back. Account named Amanda G has falsely locked her account. Twitter gave the quartering a similar reasoning for Venti as Venti for his suspension. While Blue threatened Venti and the quartering with lawsuits, in a YouTube video, the quartering, the quartering claimed that he welcomed, welcomed Blue to take him to court and claimed, It seems like it's going to be a very expensive lawsuit for you, my friend. He then encouraged viewers to sign up for his newsletter and said he would update subscribers on the depending lawsuit. Anna, that Star Wars girl, love her, also chimed in Blue's comments, stating, and I quote, <clears throat> This is such bullshit. The photos were, were from a public music video you consented to that's been up for YouTube for over six years with zero age restrictions. You didn't like you didn't like that, so you and your goons abused at Twitter support system to get Bitty Venti banned. It's fucked up. Stop lying. After the suspension, several other YouTubers and fans also echoed their support for Venti and the Quarterly. Though Twitter has systems like this in place to stop, to try to stop, try to put a stop to serious issues like revenge porn, it appears that Agra River was stripped as a massive error in this instance. It's it's coercing, it's concerning to see that the platform might deplatform people over screenshots for public places like YouTube. I and honestly, I feel like this is really bad. Honest, this is really bad to be perfectly honest. And honestly, in my honest, and this is my honest opinion, I am entitled to my opinions and my opinions alone. I feel like this is fucked up. This is fucked up on Eliza Blue's part because she did because it apparently all she had to do, all she had to fucking do. Was just come out and tell her, oh yeah, I mean I did those, vid I did that video, that what that 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 was that was me when I that was me. I'm now a changed person. That's all you ever do. But instead, she decided to do this shady ass shit and decided to mm, I don't know uh, what's he do. Oh yeah, get um get um Brittany Venti and the quartering uh locked out the locked out of their Twitter accounts. Might as well add yellow flash to the mix too, because he, she got, she got him too. It was, the, all I'm saying is that that you that all this is doing is making her look bad while making um the quartering yellow flash and Brittany Venti look really good. I mean, it was it was that bad. It it was that, that bad. It it really is. It really fucking is. But will but will she ever admit fault? No, no, she won't. She'll act like like many people like people like her. All she's gonna do is just act like, oh, I'm the victim. Oh, woe is me. You should feel sorry for me. Without any, without no, no sense of her being a bad person. Cause when you play the victim card, it's never your fault. It's everyone's fault. 
Like I, I swear, I, I'm really sick and tired of that fucking car. I mean, the victim card is way. If you want my honest opinion, and this is my, if you want my honest opinion, the victim card is way wor is way more fucking terrible than play, than playing the fucking black card or any kind of fucking race card. And I mean, and I mean that on, and I mean that on motherfucking God. So honestly, I don't like it when Britney Venti, the quarterly, and the other flash are getting fucking banned off of Twitter because they share a publicly, a, fo a photo, a screenshot of a publicly made music uh, hip hop video. Which, by the way, if I, which, by the way. Her, her and her goon, her and her goon squad managed to get the video scrubbed off the internet. You can't find. I bet you can't. You can't find it on YouTube. If you did, if you did, well, that'd be cool. But if you go to world to world star hip hop, ugh, can't believe my ex, ugh. But if you go there, it is completely scrubbed off. Like she's trying to hide hide her evidence, man. I mean, seriously. It, like seriously, this is really fucking terrible, man. It's really fucking terrible. And also, all this, all this situ, all this fucking situation is making her look bad. It's making her fucking look bad. Sick in my damn head. I'm sick in my damn head on this, on this one. And also, if I'm, and also Elon Musk, if you're listening to this, and I'm, if you're listening to this, you gotta, you gotta make, you gotta. Fix this shit. You gotta make. You gotta set everything right, man. Because honestly, you can't. You you can't let this shit. You can't let this shit. Um, go. You can't let people like her get away with this shit and go do this shit to other people and then get away with it unscathed. You gonna have to bring the hammer down on this one. You gonna have to show that you you don't fuck around and, t and show people the term fuck around and find out. The equation, my motherfucker. But that's just the ramblings of. Uh, a 36. Uh, but then again, this is just the this is just the ramblings of a 36 year old dishwasher who dishwasher by day, gamer by night. Night. But uh, I would like to know what you think of the whole situation. As always, be sure to leave a comment, like this video, subscribe to this channel. Click the notification bell so you don't miss another update. Share for friends, share for your neighbors, share for your others, and that's about it. Until next time, this is Sean007-1986 signing off. Thank you for watching this video. It really means a lot. I'm going to get this out before I go to sleep tonight. And I will see you in the next one. Catch you later. Bye! Also, I stand with Brittany Venti, The Quartering, and Yellow Flash. Motherfuckers.